so this is the starting of week two. Week two. Okay, so here is week two. Here are the new ones. So here is the comparison of the two. These are my two top ones. You can definitely tell that this tooth is coming in this time around. Oh my God. Mm. Holy crap, I'm gonna be in pain today. Ah. Oh my God, that hurts. Okay, so week two is definitely going to hurt. This is crazy. So I'm not gonna lie, today is Tuesday. So I'm a day early, but I kept feeling like as if the aligners were getting a little too easy to put in. So I decided I wanted to just go ahead and be a little bit early, start my next week today. So this is how they're looking. So I used I don't know what these are called, but I did use these. I might try to chew on them throughout the day to make sure that they are flushed, meaning to make sure that they are aligning with my teeth. Sorry if I sound a little monotone. I was excited coming into this, but this one is painful. I'm gonna be 100% honest right now. These, This one is kind of painful. I know everybody's process is gonna be different, so I don't need people telling me that I'm over dramatic or whatever the case is. Everybody's process is different. Everybody's pain tolerance is different. This tooth is what's hurting the most. So Alex just gave me Tylenol and I am 1000% taking these today. Let me just say, I was not anticipating for these aligners to be this tight. My first one was definitely not this tight. I don't even know how much I'm supposed to be biting on these. How do I know if it's flushed? It hurts. Ow. Oh. I really hope these are not gonna be hard to take out. I don't think that'll be hard. Actually, I don't know. I feel like the process might be, actually it might be a little more inconvenient than braces. Because that pain, like you just pointed out when you take them out and stuff. You think one day is actually gonna make a difference as far as how this feels? I would keep the regular ones on and swap it on the day it tells you. It's like um, 3 15 ish. I just wanted to jump back on real quick. I don't know if I regret putting them in a day earlier. I did check my schedule and I am supposed to be pretty much talking all day long on Thursday. So I'm hoping that the pain will subside a little bit by then. So part of me is kind of happy that I started it a day early. I'm kind of getting hungry, which means I'm kind of getting nervous to take these out and put them back in. Um, I don't know, pain, beauty is pain. I'm currently getting ready to make myself some ramen. Again, I apologize if my energy seems very low. It is because I am in pain. And I'm also very nervous to take these out because I don't know how painful it's gonna be. I also don't know how painful it's gonna be to actually eat. So per usual, I like to add some seasonings to my ramen because I don't like my food bland. So I think I'm gonna add some garlic salt. I'm gonna add some chicken stock or gado de pollo. I'm gonna put a little bit more water in here just so it can mix up the seasonings a little bit more. Right. And then I like to try to bend this back to keep it closed a little bit. It doesn't work, but whatever. I'm gonna pop it in for like 2.30. I don't like my ramen to be super cooked. I don't know if I already showed you guys earlier after I put them in. I also don't plan to do this again as far as going a day earlier into changing my aligners mostly because I did google it and it says it's not recommended to speed up your, your process. I just wanted to do it this time because I didn't feel anything with the original ones. I didn't feel like it was changing anything else so I just figured like a day early wouldn't hurt. I feel a lot of pressure here in the front and then I think on these like two back teeth I feel a lot of pain. Is that blood? What? I just realized that the lighting was terrible at that angle. Yeah, so I'm gonna let this cool down a little bit and then maybe I'll be back to show you guys me taking out my aligners. I may not. I may wait until later, like dinner time. So we're going to go get some dinner at Jersey Mike's. My teeth are feeling a little bit better. They're still like slightly sore, but like I think they're getting used to the tightness now so it doesn't feel as like bad but i haven't started eating yet i haven't like eaten anything yet what <sighs> i haven't eaten anything yet besides my ramen nothing to like actually chew into or bite into i'm nervous because this tooth these two teeth on the side hurt really bad 
What I used to do with mine, I used to chew on one side. Oh yeah, I hate that though. Dude, look at my fucking tan. Shit's ugly. These cookies. This looks so good. Oh my goodness. We're just looking around. We haven't been here before. Yeah, they're the same bags. Bag secured. Oh, that hurt the way I said that. I like bit with my teeth and my lips together and it crackled. What? I crackle sometimes. The bottoms are not bad at all to take off. Ah. This is a messy ass friggin' sandwich. Holy shit. I got a Philly cheesesteak. Uh, you got something spicy? The buffalo chicken sandwich, but the chicken feels more like ground beef. It's weird. And they're very super soft. I hope you even like this. I'm not gonna lie, this doesn't look great. This shit is soggy as too. I think Jimmy John's is definitely a little better. Mmm. It hurt. Oh my god, yeah. My teeth are sore. I'm gonna take a quick shower because I feel like Mirda and hopefully it'll make me feel a little bit better. Plus I look like Mirda too. So see you guys in like two seconds. It's 7.54. I just got out of the shower. I'm going to drink a Truly. Drink responsibly. I am 25 because I'm hoping that I won't have trouble sleeping tonight and getting in a drink or two really does help me sleep. I know I could just take melatonin, but I don't want to. I'd rather just take a drink when I have one. I'm not in like a crap ton of pain right now, but it's definitely still very uncomfortable and I'm not excited to have to put them back in. And I'm not excited about how sore they might be early in the morning tomorrow. So I may see you guys when I am doing my teeth, like brushing them and everything before bed or in the morning. We'll see. And here is a surprise guest, Sushi Poochie Coochie. Dicky Winky Spinky. Daddy Waddy Fatty. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so it's nine o'clock. I'm gonna try to make this as quick as possible because my camera is dying. I just got done with two drinks. I'm really hoping I'm gonna be able to sleep tonight. My camera is literally about to die. Let me get the charger. Please, please do not die on me. So anyways, I'm gonna try to make this as quick as possible. Um, I need a clip so I can clip my hair back. Here is a clip. Okay, so I have my Sonicare toothbrush. All right, now I'm gonna fill up my water pick with some water and then use my under the gum arrogance. Then I'm gonna floss real quick with my regular flosser. Not my normal regular one, I use different ones. Don't use the same one every time. And then the worst dreaded part. So the bottom one is fine. It's not that painful, but it is tight. I really need to stop putting in the bottom one first because then it like, it reminds me that the top is a lot worse. I don't think you guys understand like how much I'm dreading this. Obviously I paid 2K for this to make my teeth beautiful. If you hear screaming, it's Alex. I don't apologize. He can do that. If anybody else has had the same exact experience, please comment down below. <sighs> I just need to do it. I just need to do it. Ah! I have been needing to use this pretty much all day since I started it. Somebody else please let me know if this is normal to have to be using every, like, all day. Because it still doesn't feel flushed with my teeth. Like, I genuinely mean it when I say that these feel so tight on my teeth. This could not be what the normal experience is or pain level. So here is what they look like. I'm trying to get a good angle with good lighting. So this is what they're looking like. If you guys saw the last video, you guys know that this one was my major issue. And it is crazy to see that there's already an immensely big difference from when I first started a week ago. You can already see that it's like starting to face downward. But anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and um, lay down, get ready for bed. I will see you guys in the morning when I get up, do my regular morning routine with my teeth. Good night, hopefully everybody has a good night and see you guys in the morning.
8.42, we clock in. I just got done pretty much getting ready for the morning. I did not change or anything. I'm just going to say in this, I work from home, I don't care. This is week two, day two essentially. Surprisingly, when I woke up this morning, my bottom teeth are the teeth that are hurting pretty badly. I could barely even take my aligners out because of how much they were hurting. I ended up using mouthwash today to see if it would help. I don't think it did. I'm gonna try to drink like some hot tea or hot coffee, hoping that would help. I know Alex looked up um, something for like, you know, when you're having pain with aligners and they said to use like tyl like crushed Tylenol like around your gums. I don't know if I want to do that, but I mean, we'll see. I, I do need to go take some Tylenol. I don't think I have any in here with me. Oh, surprising, ideal. And a little bit of water. Let me just say, Tylenol is much needed today. Oh, and thank Suchi. And thank God. My schedule normally changes frequently throughout the day, but for today, it looks like I'm supposed to just be in task work, which basically means that I don't really have to be on the phones at all today, not unless I have to make like an outbound call. So I'm very thankful for that. I really was not up to talking at all today. My mouth really hurts especially the bottom ones like i said the bottom ones is what's killing me the most which is funny because i didn't have any pain at all yesterday when i was taking in and out my aligners let me pull up a picture of what they looked like before i started i don't know if you're if you're even gonna see a difference i don't know if i do yeah minor minor difference my camera's about to die so i'm gonna charge it for a little bit and i will check back in in a little bit probably when i'm having coffee a few moments later okay, so alex just made me some hot coffee oh. hey he called just to say this why ah anyways so alex made me some coffee pretty hot i'm kind of nervous because i don't know if it's gonna hurt ow my shoulder just popped i'm getting cold I'd be a little sensitive I'm gonna let it cool down just a little bit more and then I'll be right back. I only have about an hour and 19 minutes left for how much storage I have. So, so Alex made me breakfast. I'm sorry. feel like cleaning my teeth so ah just don't think about it don't think about it don't don't think about it it's getting easier again what if i just started smiling like that because this is my normal smile and then what if i just started smiling like this i think it looks weird right probably all right, so I am clearly a bad YouTuber. I have not recorded. I don't think I recorded all day yesterday. I was in a lot of pain the day before that, and then a little bit of pain yesterday. I was also really busy with editing as well. But anyways, today is March 8th. It is Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Day three of week two. Alex just made me some coffee, so I went ahead and took out my aligner so I can drink my coffee. Mm. The last couple of days, I want to recap a little bit. So obviously the first day that I changed into my next new aligner for week two, it's very, very, very painful. Alex ended up going to get his teeth cleaned yesterday. So I did have him ask the dentist a couple of questions that I just didn't get to ask him when I first got my aligners. He did say it is pretty normal for the pain, especially for your first three. My first one was not painful. My second one was very painful. One of the things I really wanted to talk about is how annoying the transition is from getting new teeth and everything. I don't know if anybody ever talks about this. I'm, I'm obviously on my second aligner. This is the reason of the whole video. You guys know this. So I have definitely noticed that my bite is very different. If anything, it like kind of makes me want to cry a little bit because I can't chew like normal when I'm eating certain things. Like I can't bite down all the way. These teeth, I don't think like it doesn't feel like they're coming together as I used to. This one over here 
is in like a weird place and I think these ones might need to be moving too so they're kind of like colliding with each other a little bit so it's also kind of preventing me from biting down all the way it's not that big of a deal I can obviously eat and everything it's just a little frustrating because I can't chew like normal so I decided to change the angle because I think the sliding is a little bit better so yeah the main issue right now at this point is that I can't bite down like normal that's probably the most frustrating part but as far as pain I don't really have any more pain that much like even when putting in and taking out my aligners I don't really have that much pain anymore the only thing that I would say I have is a little bit of discomfort because of the positions of my teeth right now mostly just this one which I'm probably going to be talking about that for a while because that's my biggest concern so that might be the one that gives me the most issues but yeah that's pretty much the most recent update there's not really a whole lot to talk about i may or may not even end up doing these every month i don't know do like a six episode series you guys let me know so that is what everything is looking like so far. I will try to keep up and record throughout the day. I am also recording a day in the life for TikTok, so I might be pretty sporadic, but yeah, I will see you guys in a little bit. I could be a